Okay, I'm not editing this, so if the audio levels are trash, then you'll just have to deal with it. So apparently no one can figure out how to use an HTML wallpaper with Wallpaper Engine. It's actually pretty simple. Uh, all you have to do is open your favorite text editor to make an HTML file. Let's go to save, save as, oop, boop. Change to say .html, yay, okay. Ba -da 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 -da. If you're using a regular text editor, just have this say all files. Make sure that it ends .html in the file name though. Save, ta-da, you made an HTML file. You're, you're a god now. Pop up on your desktop, and then you get to actually write the HTML file. Go ahead, fill in the basic shit. And then once you're done with that, you can go ahead and add the actual content of it. If I just type some stuff in here, um, everything except the asdif is just what needs to be in the HTML file. Just go ahead and copy this over, and you'll be good to go. Anything you put in the body will be displayed in Wallpaper Engine. Uh, just come over here, open file, let it throw an error because my shit is broken. Select your HTML file you just created, hit open, ta-da. See over in the top, there's the shit that you put. Uh, that's not very great though, so I'm gonna go head over to something I made. Uh, you can find my stuff here if you're wondering. CodePen.io slash short, and here's all the wacky shit that I make. So if you wanna use one, hop over here to where it says HTML, click the little dropdown, view compiled, and we'll just right click, hit select all, right click, hit copy, and I'm just going to paste that uh, right here, let's see, paste, bam, that's in the body now. Uh, I'm not going to clean it up, it's not worth it. Uh, I'm going to go up here to before it says slash head, and type in style, and a slash style, and I'm going to come over here to where it says CSS, which is what makes everything look pretty, and click drop down, hit View, oops, hit view compiled, and do the same thing. Just select all, hit copy, and we're gonna paste it right in here where we just made that style bit. And it's a lot of code. Alright, we'll hit save, jump back over to wallpaper engine. I'm just gonna remove this thing and open it again. So open from file, open, oops, uh, click on the one that you just did, and ta da. Enjoy your wallpapers.